Is it, does it light up still? Yeah. Oh Welcome to the channel. I'm Sean with Emerald Coast Digitizing. I convert tapes and films to digital here in Pensacola, Florida. If you need someone to do this for you, check out my website, EmeraldCoastDigitizing.com. Let's get on with the video. Today we've got VHSC tapes and we've got a bunch of them. They are really well labeled. Oh man, just getting really lucky with the labeling guys. Look at that. This makes things so much easier. I don't have to do any of this stuff I normally have to do. I just gotta make sure they're all here real quick. All right, 43, 41, 42, 43, 44, 45, 46. 47, 48. So this is great. Because these things are labeled so well, um, I probably won't even put my own labels on these. If you send your stuff out like this, this is really, really put together. And now, wouldn't it be amazing if they were all rewound? Let's find out. There's no way that these are all rewound. Nope. All right, so we're gonna have to do quite a bit of rewinding. Get out. I don't know if I'm gonna really get started on this job today. Uh, I'm feeling pretty freaking tired and I kind of just wanna relax. So working on that film, obviously, but you need to plug this thing in too. And then once that film once that VHS tape film transfer is done up there, then I need to go through and clean and adjust every one of these VCRs before I can get into this next job. So I'm probably just going to do some rewinding and maybe uh, get started on like six of them, six or seven of them. I had a bunch of customers come in today, uh, drop off. I got some film in the store. Hey, how's it going, man? Good, yes, sir. Yeah. I'm David. Yeah. How you doing, man? I'm just sorry. I do videos David. Yeah, I'm Facebook. Oh, sweet. You came by. Yeah. Oh, sweet, man. Yeah, let's check it out. You want to okay. bring it in? Yeah. Awesome, dude. Thanks for bringing it in, man. You mind? I had to go to, we went to, uh, to uh, Joe Patty's, so I figured I'd come over here. Oh, dude, that's so cool. I wasn't sure if I was going to hear back from you. Oh man, that's sweet. Oh yeah, does it, does it light up still? Yeah. I do. Oh I man, plug, I plugged it in earlier. I don't really need a bunch of yeah. stuff like this here. I got kind of a small store, uh -huh. but um, I thought it was cool. I just was happening. I was looking for a store sign for my mm -hmm. road, and I just happened to see it. You I was like, it. TDK. That's. Yeah, that's you can't a, buy. It. I got this when I worked music stores 15 years. I know they do a lot of audio film, but they do. Uh, yeah. I wouldn't be surprised if this tape right here is a TDK. No, it's JVC. I got TDK stuff back here. Yeah, yeah here, here's an unopened uh, TDK VH oh, head yeah. cleaner. Yeah, really. It's kind of cool. I don't I know. I don't, I most up. people won't care. But, uh, yeah. oh, look at that. That's cool. Yes, yeah, so I post daily content on my YouTube for my business. All right. This is sweet. How much did you want? 25 bucks yeah. for it? Oh, man. Uh, get more, but I Sold. <laughs> Maybe I not around here. More, but I figured out, well, I've had it for years. I mean, I, I got it back in the 80s. Man, I'd be happy that's when, to buy. That's what I worked. Uh, oh no! No, no. Oh no! Yeah, I mean, I got stand-ups. I got the TK poster. You know, the one with the hair blown back. I do not know what you're talking about, but I you would love to see that it. Don't remember that commercial. But I'm kind of a nerd about the uh, the old analog stuff these days. I got tons of I got a bunch of Betamax players back here. I'm trying to get yeah. fixed, and I don't do any reel to reel audio, but I really should start. Do you have reel to reel machines? I got two reel to reels. I really wanted to give them more. I know it's worth more than twenty five. Those are real ones. I wish, day. dude. I wish. Yeah. Uh, I wish just, they were real. Yeah, they're the remake. Yeah, I just had some stuff printed out just to have something mm -hmm. on the walls. I thought it was cool. I used to have them whenever I was younger, but someone broke into my house and oh no! Uh, what was it? I was living with roommates uh -huh. and their friend. Well, here's here's 25. I was gonna try to give okay. you a little bit more, but I didn't. Right. 
I just don't have it. I thought I had. Usually I have fifty dollars of change in here. Maybe someone came in and took that too. But I had a, uh, I had a uh, a buddy who lived with me who had some some pretty bad friends, and they oh, really? came in and stole a bunch of stuff and tore all posters off no, the wall. Really? Yeah, was, no. I mean this was back when I was twenty two. I'm forty, almost forty now. But yeah. dude, this is super cool, man. I don't know where I'm gonna put it, but I'm excited to have. It. This guy right here can go up here next to my certainly proud of that oh this thing is so cool man look at that Woo! i don't know why i get so excited about the littlest things that no one else gets excited about all right got a little sidetrack guys uh, <laughs> i guess this video is gonna be a little different than the other ones but got one tape around here I think this is going to be a fun little job, hopefully. I mean, there's still a chance that we're going to have tons of problems, but we got to get at least a few of these going today. Can't spend the whole day up here just doing one tape, so we got to at least do 10 in a day. It feels good to be doing a different format today. It's just like I'm doing all VHS every day. Finally, something a little different. Finally. Yeah, I come up here and I just maybe edit a video or do ads. I can't every day come up here and work on tapes. I have other stuff I have to do for the business that requires attention aside from the tapes. So I was gonna make today one of those days where all I did was Facebook ads, taxes and stuff like that, but I uh had four customers come in just walk in today so I'm having to that took up some time and then I made it into a fun day with a TDK sign so we're not just we're just not getting a ton of stuff done today Okay, now we're good. <laughs> Looking good. These are nice standard play, 30 minute long VHS C tapes. So we shouldn't be able to make quick work of this, hopefully. It, I have to say it is nice to not have to label them. The fact that they, they labeled it made it so much easier. There's good things and there's bad things about tapes that play perfectly. The good thing is it's going to be an easy job. The bad thing is I tend to discount people because I like to be honest and I can't charge someone the same price for easy, clean, well taken care of tapes as I have to charge someone for neglected, badly stored tapes that take hours and hours and hours of extra time to do a good job transferring. So if all these tapes act the way these first two have then this person's looking at way a little bit less or maybe even way less than what I quoted them just because I'm super happy to be able to do it easily and it not tear up any of my machines and hopefully they have uh, maybe some more family members and they have tapes you never know Every individual family has their own sets of tapes. Think about that. So if you do a good job for, if you do a good job for someone, then their sister may have tapes. Their brother may have tapes. Their parents may have tapes. It's like a whole thing. Parents have film, you know? 
It's like for every one family, you might get four or five different jobs. So it's important to do good, good work and tell them like, hey, like if you got anybody else that you know and you're happy, send them my way. And these tapes look amazing, guys. Wow. It just, it's nice to be reassured that it's not your players. It's always the tapes. I mean, the dates are just amazing. This person probably did really well in life if they did such a good job organize, keeping this organized. And maybe they did this recently. After this job, we're gonna be doing um, eight millimeter tapes. You know what, I haven't, I haven't put this tape in, in a while. Let's see what's on the Earmore Coast digitizing tape. Let's see what's on here. I don't remember what's on this tape. Richard Gear, it's pretty woman, guys. The Earmore Coast digitizing tape is pretty woman. And it's got an audio issue. Earmore Coast digitizing is pretty woman, guys, just so. Well, you're gonna use that. That's gonna be something you wanna remember when we do the giveaway. I'm gonna do a giveaway and it's gonna be in the next few videos and the answer to the giveaway question will be pretty woman. <laughs> All right, you got good audio. That's good. I think this will be a good job to work on tomorrow. We'll be able to potentially finish this whole job tomorrow. So just to get started, get an idea of what we got going on so we know what we have to do tomorrow is great. This tape here is showing that there's footage on it, but it's black screen and we know it's not dirty head, but just in case we'll pull it out. We'll throw it in this player here. It's got footage, oh, it's got recording on it, but. It doesn't show what it is. So this is a situation where I do wish I had more adapters and a few more computers set up because I can make quick work of this if I had more. I mean, I'm just flying through these tapes compared to the last few videos you've seen me like Every tape I put in, I have to do something extra just to get to play. And this job alone proves that it's not my players and it's always the tapes versus the VCR. Because all my players are playing absolutely perfectly without any problems on this particular project. For the most part, these are looking freaking amazing. These look great. It's never my players, it's always the tapes. I know these videos are all over the place, but I am trying to post every day. I actually really enjoy editing these videos and I really thank you guys for watching because it makes it, it makes it so much more fun to do this when people actually watch. And I'm hoping that you get some value from this stuff. I know this is a dying business, but I'm doing my best to help my customers out, give people a good price and also add value to the YouTube community out there. And I'm really stoked about that TDK sign. I don't know why it makes me so happy, but it really does. <laughs>